Hi YouTubers, how on the case again? I'm um, going to show you today how to fit up one of these Rolson, uh, well they're security lights I guess. Yeah, no no more, no less. They switch on automatically when they sent you. Now I've had one of these fitted for nearly 18 months and it has been faultless. So I've ordered another one um, and I'm showing you where I'm going to put it and how to install it. So uh, if you come out with me and I'll show you where the other one is and where this one's going to go. All right guys. Um, and girls, here's, here's the one I fitted um, over a year ago now, well it's getting on for 16 months actually, and it's been faultless. Um, I've deliberately put it under that underhang there, well that overhang, <laughs> underhang, the overhang, just so it would keep most of the rain off of it. Um, and it's it's been faultless every time you come up or come round, because I've got steps up to my bungalow like this. Now I need the light because at night it's really dark, I didn't want to put other lights on um, and turn those on and leave them running all night because of the energy thing. So I've got these solars, took a chance, they're only 15 pound these things from Rolson very cheap I think and as I say it's been fuller so as you can see I've got more steps that run down like so um, I've got these lights that I put on the wall solar again um, but they only go for about an hour they're not sensitive to people passing by so consequently once an hour or so has gone past they go off so if you come back late at night they're quite useless so as you can see I've got these steps running up and I can't see these steps here down here at the moment uh, in the dark so I'm going to put one up here again I'm going to put it under that over under overhang get it right out um, and I'm going to show you how to fit it up there and screw it up so I'll get the things and the tools out of the box and show you how to do it all right youtubers I've decided to have my light under this overhang here uh, try and keep it out of the elements the less water on them I find the better uh, I'm going to do a couple of drill holes up here uh, and hang the bracket on there and hang it off the side of there um, I know it'll only shine on this part down here as we approach um, so I may need one further along but I'm going to stick this one up here for now so I'm going to drill two holes there first on YouTube is before I put the other screw in um, you'll see the hooks there I'm trying to get the angle right for the light I'm thinking of going like this with it um, and getting it so it will shine um, down as you come down these steps here as you can see then at least when you come down that will light up I know it won't help me too much coming up the other way but um, I do think I'll probably need one more in the middle um, to do this completely um, so I'm gonna get that in position now I've done one screw and drill the other hole and get this so that I think it'll go roughly like that for me it'll be the best position so I'm gonna do that now Okay, YouTubers, here's our, um, our panel. Um, now, what I like about these lights, uh, what I really like about them, is that they need no direct sunlight. These panels are big enough, just in daylight, with no sun at all, um, to give enough light to power these LEDs. Um, I'm gonna have it round this way. There's my light there, going up the steps that's gonna shine up as you walk up to give me some light. I'm gonna put the panel on the side. Again, I think it would be nice to keep it out of the elements a bit and put it under this overhang that I've got here. Um, and then give it some protection from the weather. I'm sure they last longer when you do that. And as you can see, I've got my, my lamp fixed up there in the position I want it in. So I'll just mark this up now and screw it up in position. Well, there we are with the finished job. Um, all up and I'll put it on for you. As you can see, um, it's all gonna work. Now I've got the sensor point in that way, um, which means as I come down these steps now, um, it should light up, especially this flat bit here, which is really dark at night. Um, so that's our finished project, and there it is. I had to put a solar light up, or a, 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 obviously a security type that switches on when it senses you. Um, for 15 quid, I do advise these Rolsons are very, very good. Okay, YouTubers, well, that's it. Thanks very much for watching, and uh, Derrick33 for more tips on stuff. Uh, see you again.